Good morning. Um, today we're going to talk a little bit about the book of Samuel. Um, the concept is listening to God. Um, and the text is from 1 Samuel 3, 9b. Speak, Lord, for your servant is listening. How many of you have ever had earphones on your ears? Or maybe the earbuds, because those are more popular right now. Why do people wear them? Earphones can help you to listen more carefully, and they can help you to listen to just what you want to hear without bothering or being bothered by others. Listening is not always easy to do, is it? Sometimes our mothers ask us to do something when we are so busy playing or doing something else that we just don't hear them. Or if you're in church school class and the teacher is telling a Bible story and you start thinking about something else, you just forget to listen and you can't remember what the story was about. Did you know that this even happens to older people in church sometimes while the minister is preaching? Our minds can start thinking about something else and we just forget to listen. The Bible tells us about a little boy named Samuel. Samuel was a very special little boy because his mother Hannah promised God that she would take Samuel to live in the temple when he was old enough to be away from home. Each year, his mother made a little robe and brought it to the temple at Jerusalem for Samuel. Samuel helped Eli, the high priest, care for the temple lamps and keep the temple clean. Samuel even slept in the temple. One night, God called to Samuel. He said, Samuel, Samuel. At first, Samuel thought it was Eli calling him, and he hurried to Eli to see what he could do for him. But Eli had not called for Samuel. When God called the third time, Eli knew it was God who was calling Samuel, and he told Samuel to say, Speak, Lord, for your servant is listening. Wasn't that a wonderful thing to say? Yes, God, I'm listening. We hear God's word in church. We hear God's word every time we read the Bible. It's so easy to forget to listen or to think about something else, so we just don't want, just don't hear what God is saying to us. When Jesus was teaching the people who followed him, he must have noticed that some people weren't listening because he said, he who has ears to hear, let him hear. God gave us ears to hear his word. We can enjoy using earphones like, like um, putting them in, when we put them in our ears. We can use ear, enjoy earbuds for listening to music, but it's more important to do what Samuel did. He listened when God spoke to him. When we hear God's word, Let's try to be good listeners, too. Um, I think that's a great message, that we need to start listening more. Even when people are talking to us, sometimes we don't really listen. We pretend to listen, and we kind of think about things that we have to do that day or things that we need to get done. And then when they're all done, they say, well, what do you think about that? And here we really haven't been listening very well. So let's work on that. Let's look up, work on being better listeners. Um, to each other, and especially to what God has in store for us. I hope you have a great day, and I will see you soon.